everyone, welcome back. Today we are going to be doing, what's it called? Missing, missing book, book challenge. challenge. Yeah. So today we're doing the missing book challenge, which was created, I believe, by Jesse the Reader. I will link his video down below. He didn't say like original challenge or anything in the in the video, so I'm not 100% sure, but I believe he created it. So basically, the premise of the game is that Will here, my boyfriend, we haven't seen him in a while, he is going to take five books from anywhere on my shelf. And that shelf over there, I don't know if they can see it. There's a tiny one. Yeah, over there. <laughs> He's gonna take five books from my shelf and hide them. I'll come back into the room. Oh, I didn't say I would leave. I'm gonna leave. He's gonna take books. He's gonna hide them. I'll come back and then I have to try to guess which books they are based on like the spots that are open on the shelf. This is gonna be kind of hard. I feel like the, it might be a little bit easier because I have them sorted by haven't read and have read. So like, if there's a spot missing here, I'll be like, oh, I haven't read the book that's missing. So I feel like that that might help differentiate a little bit. Also, I do not have as many books as Jesse the Reader does, so I feel like it might be a little bit easier because I can't imagine how hard it would be to figure out what book is missing when you have hundreds of books. So we're gonna do, what do you wanna do, three rounds? We can do three rounds. Sure. Three and rounds. you'll take five books each round. If I guess the book and the author, I get a whole point. If I have to have you like tell me who the author is, I only get half. So you're gonna have to look at the book and be like, okay. And then also oh, yeah. I'm allowed to ask three like question hints, like per round. Let's jump in. I'm nervous, but also excited. I'm leaving. All right, how do I want to, I want to try and start with an easy round. I don't know how to make this easy though. The pink and yellow, I might be giving that away. Really catching my attention. And then this one. All right, this is a big one, so she might she might get this. This is Betwixt, book number three, yeah. And then book number four. She likes these books. I'm pretty sure. I like the covers of these. They're pretty. So those are the five books. I am not even going to remember the names of the books. So let's see how this goes. I am ready for you. Uh oh, I'm scared. To okay. find out what books I have taken off of your shelf. Okay. Um. The Revolution of Mara Dyer. Yes. Yeah. That one was kind of easy. Yeah. Well, because these are the books that like are on my February TBR, so like I knew. This is. Oh. OCD Love Story. Yes. Okay. Bye. Cool. These are. Oh yeah, I forgot I'd tell you the author. This one's by Michelle Hodkin. Yep. Uh, OCD, oh gosh, I don't know. I don't know who the author is. Because I haven't read that book yet. I don't know who the author is of OCD Love Story. I don't know, dude. Just tell me. Corey and Hidu? Hidu? I don't know, I would never have gotten that. Something, Because something... I haven't read that book yet, so I'll talk about it. Nice. This one is Betwixt. Oh gosh, I don't know who the author is of that one either. Tara? You don't remember. I, I think it does start with Tara. Ooh, you're, you are very close. Tara Smith. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Bray. Tara Bray Smith? Yes. Wait, really? Yes. Oh my gosh, that yes. was a complete guess. I didn't think I knew that. Okay, other books. This one is missing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't know how that one is. I, I can give you a hint. I have a pretty good hint of it. Let me ask. Okay. What color is the cover? White. Almost cream, but mostly white. Have you read it? No. Let's not turn the one down. What's the hint that you like had in your mind? I sent you a Snapchat of this book years back with the cover, with the silly edit of the cover. <gasps> Arkham of Hearts? No. I'll give you the sun! Yes! That's what it is. Our chemical hearts was mine because I changed it to my chemical romance. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got it. It's by Jandy Nelson. Okay. Uh, so is that still half a point or a full point? That's a full point because I got the author in. But, but I don't have any more hints now. Okay. Because I, I used up all my all three of my hints. How many do we have left? One? One more. Is it, is it Which is right 
I believe over here. Let me double check to remember which book it was. <laughs> <laughs> I'll shut my eyes. Do, 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 oh, do, where was do, that book even? So it wasn't there? No, it was. It was this book right it here. It was there? I'm pretty sure it was right was, there. Is it Please Don't Go Before I Get Better? No. Right by this poetry book, which is why I think it's poetry. Oh, I don't have any hints left. Mm. <laughs> this is hard. Okay, so I have read it, and I want to read it again. Why did I decide to do this? Uh, it's a bad decision. I, it pains me, because I, I want you to know this, because I feel like it's a... I mean, I guess I don't, don't really hear you talk about it that much. Yeah, but, but I read it, obviously, because that's where it's from. Yeah. It's frustrating. You're first. It's frustrating that I don't know this! <laughs> Do you give up? Yes, but only because I don't have any hints left. Shout by Lori Halls Anderson. Oh, I just got that book, so I like it doesn't like oh. register quite like because I just bought it. Okay. Here, hold. What'd you put on? Nothing. I was just rubbing Oh, you're my just hands, rubbing your hands. Rubbing together? my hands maleficently. Maleficent? You mean maliciously? Yeah, that. Okay, that okay. was hard. How many points do I have? Three and a half for Three round one. That's a big yikes. Okay, I'm gonna go leave. Mother stinks. But you stink. No, you I, I smell you nice. Stinky. I took a nice shower. Stinky. I'm and a little cut of lemon. You smell like. You smell like beef? Dove. I smell, <laughs> I like, smell like beef. beef. Okay, round one was just the top shelf, so you could all see what's going on. This round, I'm gonna get a little bit um, interesting and take one from each shelf. One from each, because there's four on here and one there. So. Oh. Alright, we're gonna take this one. This is an interesting book. I don't even know what it's about, but it, it looks very interesting. This book is from her favorite band, Alice Anna. Taking this big boy from the end. Hopefully this won't be too hard because it's pretty big. I feel like she'd remember this being there. Taking this book because it's got a lot of math in it. This is from the bottom shelf, Abundance of Catherine's. This is the book from the shelf on the end. Strange and Beautiful Sorrows. She's talked so much about this book. It sounds so weird, but super interesting. I am ready for you to guess more books. Uh oh, big spooked. So this one. Yes. Is Going Bovine by Little Bray. Wow. That okay. The shelf I feel like I know the best because it's the highest. I don't know. Yeah. Um. That one. Let me get them. <laughs> Point board. That one is Ninth House by Lee Bardugo. Okay, it's one mi the one's missing here. Is it was it like on this side? Like which where was it? Right it here? was on this side. Of the it was on that side? Mm-hmm. Annabelle by yeah. Alice Santa. Yeah. There's one down there. There's two more. Yes, there is one down there. Where's the other one? Over here. Oh! What's that? Uh Bluish purple. Purplish blue. It's like blue and purple. Let's get that one. I want to see if I can guess that one. What color is the cover of that one? White. It took me a second to remember what book that was. White. Uh, pure white is the cover. Well, not pure white, but it's not like cream. It's just straight up white. What books do I have? <laughs> it's white? Yeah. I can't think of a white book that I own that's not ah. on the shelf right now. <laughs> And Abundance of Catherine's? Yes! Yes! Okay, so I still have one more clue clue to get me that one. Yes. I feel like that should be easy because that's the pile that I want to take home and that pile is so tiny. So like there's only so many books. How many words in the title? Eight. Eight? Eight. Eight words? In the title, yes. I can't think Eight of- Eight words in the title? I can't think of any long titles. Uh, Eight words? Yes. Was it That's your last hint. Ah! <laughs> so we fall for it. Eight? Yes. I, I just counted it a second time. I it can't is eight words. think of a book title that I have that might be eight words long. That isn't like already on the shelf. I give up. The Strange and Beautiful Sorrows of Oh no! <laughs> I can't believe I didn't get that! I'm like, you should get that. that you talked about that book so much when you were reading it. Ugh, I can't believe I didn't get that. I'm so angry! Okay, I'm disappearing again. I'm watching you. You cannot watch. You must leave. Mm, I'm listening to you. Mm, okay, then I'm gonna be silent. No, talk to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, 
camera is going low on battery. Let's hope it keeps recording. Okay, I'm gonna make this quick. Last round, I'm gonna make it difficult. I wanna pick books that I have either not heard of or have barely heard of from her. This book, Commonwealth by Ann Patchett. I believe this is a memoir. Just kidding, it literally said novel on the cover. I'm an idiot. This book I have never heard of in my life. If she has read this, I'm a complete doofus because I don't remember her reading it. I don't remember this one either. I know she likes Sarah Dessen, or at least like reads a few of her books, but I don't recognize the name Dreamland. Okay, she just read this one recently, but it's recent, so she might not know that it's on there. And one more book. This one, I, I do remember her vaguely talking about this, but I don't remember hearing um, much when she was reading it, so let's see how she does. Also, okay, camera back. camera is on low battery. So. Uh oh! Hopefully it doesn't die. I hope it doesn't. Hopefully we will have to charge it. Okay, let's go. Um, this one. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know if I know any of these. Yeah, I, this is this okay. is gonna be the hard one. That one is. Nope, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, girl, wash your face. Yes. I don't know who the author is. Wait, don't tell me. Uh, I feel like so stressed because we're running out of time because camera. I don't know who the author is. Okay, who is it? Uh, I don't know. Oh, good. <laughs> I didn't look the author. <laughs> is this a Sarah Dessen book? You told me. Ah, uh, I don't like when you do that. <laughs> Why do I have so many standalones about a series? This would be so much easier. <laughs> what color is this cover? It's white. White? Yes. Okay, so the camera died, so we had to stop charge the battery and while we were doing that we were eating lunch so if there's any angle changes or lighting changes we apologize I'm still learning how to how to work a camera how to I, yeah so anyway I don't think I guessed any of these books no I did I got girl, girl wash, wash your face. face you didn't get the author though I won't count this as a hint one of them is Sarah Dessen but not this one not this one no. is one of them dreamland yes that was I want to that was again. dreamland by Sarah, by Sarah Dessen. Dessen I'll give you one more hint one more. Okay, fine. What color is that one's cover? Black and blue. Black and blue? Spine is black, the cover is blue. Yes, mostly blue. <gasps> We're the fourth piece of stars! Yes! Ah, I got yes. it! Yes! By Glendy Vanderoff. That's awesome. the other. <laughs> this one, I thought you read for a class, but I was thinking of no. um, The Ugly Truth, or whatever that was called. Commonwealth! Yes! Commonwealth. By Ann Patchett. Yeah, Truth and Beauty. Truth and Beauty. That's the one I read for class. I was thinking of Truth and Beauty, but Commonwealth. I, I'm giving you a lot of hints I know, for these. but I, my brain is dumb. Okay, this one I think I'm going to give up on. That is, what is it? Four girls, five days or something? Four people, five days. Four people, five um, days. I, Three and a half. I'm taking one point off for all the hints I gave you. What? You dictator. All right, fine. You can, you can add Fascist. that full point if you want. You, you can give yourself Yay. a three point five. In, in my eyes, I'm taking a point off because I give you so many hints. I'm giving myself it because I love myself. <laughs> Final score: three point five for the first round, four for the second round, and three point five for the last round. Will said he was taking away one of my points, but I gave it back because patriarchy. <laughs> <laughs> but that is it for the missing a book challenge. Missing the book challenge? I don't remember what it was called. Missing book. Missing challenge. book challenge. Okay. Uh, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure you're subscribed. Don't follow me on social media. All my links are in the description box down below as always. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope this video is watchable because I don't quite know how a camera works yet. We're still figuring it out. But thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!